Hey everyone, it's MK. Welcome back to MK Quilts and MK Quilts University. I am bringing you right now a little bit of a special extended introduction to this Dream Big Holiday Poinsettia course. So behind me, of course, is my stitch out of the Dream Big Poinsettia. Of course, this is from our friends at Hoffman Fabrics. Now this course started out with a set, a digital set for this panel from my friend and designer, Celeste Theo. Now a little bit of backstory about this course. As of the recording of this video, which is in March of 2022, I actually started this course back in the fall of 2021. At that time, I was ordering panels from Hoffman. They said they would be in very quickly. And so I proceeded with my stitch out and the course content. Then of course, our supply chain issues kicked in and I wasn't able to get the panels in short order like I had planned. The holidays passed us by and I still didn't have the panels. So I decided to change gears a little bit in this course and take it a little bit further and include other stitch outs, other sets and other panels into the course. So the first thing I wanna let you know is that this whole course started with content that I recorded for you regarding a technique within Pro Stitcher Premium called reposition zero. Now, if you don't know anything about what I'm talking about with that functionality, it's a way of positioning designs based on X and Y coordinates. If you're still not sure what I'm talking about, well, then you're gonna wanna take this course. Now, as I mentioned, that's where the course started, but I definitely went in new directions and included other sets and other whole cloth type stitch out content into this course. So I'm now calling this more of a master level course. It's maybe not for the beginner among you, but I think that you'll be very pleasantly surprised to learn about X and Y coordinates and how you might use the reposition zero to your benefit. So let me just show you a few of the other stitch outs and panels that are covered in this course. And hopefully this will pique your interest and you will take this course. You will learn about laying out whole cloths from a set, from a designer, different ways to approach that layout and different ways to approach the stitch out. So as mentioned behind me, this was the Dream Big Poinsettia panel and the name of the set used on this stitch out was from Celeste and the name of the set is Multifarious Dream Big Holiday Poinsettia and Celeste's website is called A Bit Orange. Also included in this course is a set that fits this beautiful panel. This panel is a digitally printed panel that I purchased from a company called Legit Kit. And I, you can see I haven't had time to stitch it out, but I did drop content here in the course. Again, using one of Celeste's set. Her set is called Autumn the Fox. She has a few different, two or three different uh, configurations of designs that you can that you can purchase. And I'm very excited to get this stitched out because I think it's going to be absolutely glorious. And I chose the panel option because I just didn't have time to piece this beautiful quilt. So Hoffman has come out with several of these dream big panels digitally printed. And this one is one of the latest ones that I stitched out. This one is called dream big dance. And the set that I used on this one was from another very talented designer in our industry. Her name is Nancy Hackey, and she is the owner of Wasatch Quilting. Again, Nancy has a couple of different sets that you can purchase to stitch out this beautiful panel. And I don't know if it shows really well. I'm gonna bring this a little closer to the camera. But when I was done with this stitch out, 
I went ahead and did some hot fix crystals and it really is just beautiful. Not sure it's showing up real, real well on camera, but this was a fun, fun stitch out. So in the course, I'm showing you how to do this set as well. Now, last but not least, I wanted to bring out a couple of Dream Big panels. These were the original Dream Big panels that Hoffman came out with, and I actually stitched this one out, gosh, probably two, two and a half years ago. And I'm bringing these panels back into this course as a way to show you, you know what? I grow as a quilter, and as I grow as a quilter and an instructor, I want to bring you new and innovative ways to think about laying out these sets and stitching out these panels. So I'm kind of revisiting the way that I taught this course a couple years ago, and I'm giving you some new things to think about, some new ways to set that up. I have a couple more stitch outs that I wanted to show you. I will also drop pictures of these so that you can see the backs as well. This one is really fiery and happy, isn't it? And then finally, I wanted to share this stitch out. This stitch out and the last two that I showed you were using digital sets from Urban Elements. And this particular stitch out, I didn't even load the panel. I just stitched out the designs. So there is a lot of content packed into this course. You're probably gonna need a week to digest everything that I'm teaching you and then order up some of these panels and give it a go. It's a lot of fun and I guarantee you, it's gonna push you to learn your software better. In this course, I am focusing on use of Pro Stitcher Premium and Pro Stitcher Designer. So if you have those softwares and you've always wondered how to use them as it relates to a whole cloth, then this course is for you. Enjoy it, you guys. I always welcome your feedback. And of course, I love to see your stitch outs. So keep watching, hop on into the class, share your stitch outs at the end. And until next time, from my studio to yours, Happy quilting, everybody. Bye-bye.